Hi guys, Random here. Yeah, back with a bit more Elite Dangerous. Uh, you join me just heading to Zash. Zashka. Zashka. Depot. You join me heading to this place um, that you can see just there. Um, it's a. Oh, don't panic. I've been sent to find you, says Ool. Well, I'm not panicking, Ool. Let's have a look and see what you're flying, shall we? A Cobra, so you're not really going to present that big of a challenge if you do get a bit frisky. Oh, no, you're one of these. I'm going to drop down. Can you follow me? I could, but I'm not going to. Right. So, yeah, I was uh, just loading up a few missions and uh, here in Gugaini, and um, there were two in system for this Dashka depot so I thought I'd head there in fact I'll show you the, uh, the missions I've got here so yeah go to Irakuma and two there for Dashka depot so yeah I thought why not it would be rude not to take advantage of the reputation and the money um, so let's head over there I've not really poked around much in uh, Gugaini, to be honest. I'll just stick at Shen. Every now and again I'll get uh, the urge to go off to one of the rings and do a little bit of fighting there, which is nice. Good way to earn money. Um, oh, oh, here we go. Look. Jed Garner. Oh, God. Let's submit to the interdiction so we don't get any damage let's see what you're in, you're in an ASP explorer well this is the biggest mistake of your life pal which by the way is about to end oh you there, yeah there we go Look, we shall uh, do the killing I feel if well launching missiles is that's a ring off his shields. There we go. Right. Let's melt you, shall we? Target Apparently there'll be no escape for me. Right. Okay. How's that working out for you, Jed? Um, apparently I've chosen that this day will be my last. Have I? No, I don't think I have. Okay, thanks for playing, Jed. See you again soon, perhaps. Preferably when you're worth a bit more money. 47,000's not bad. All goes in the Anaconda Fund. Three, two, one, engage. Or could it be the Cutter Fund? Hmm. Well, grinding out these missions is uh, helping the rank out. If we have a look there, you'll see Baron 47%. It's creeping up. It is creeping up. Uh, Explorer rate on uh, rank on 86% Trailblazer, which is pretty good. Which is pretty good. So it won't be long. Another few little uh, ventures out in space. I might get myself uh, either a Diamondback Explorer or another Asp Explorer, maybe it out for some long distance because you can't really do it in the clipper not with its 21 light year jump range it takes forever you know you want to find bits of space preferably other people haven't because you get paid more for them and seeing as the uh, the rank is connected to how much you've earned it's uh, it kind of makes sense to want to go for the the big money ones So yeah, I'm not doing too bad. I mean, the uh, combat rank, 40% expert, that's, that's not too bad. I'm quite happy with that. You get that, uh, you know, you get in the old resource rings. Uh, resource sites in the rings and uh, claim some bounties. And that goes up nicely. Right, so we are coming into Zashka depot which is on the planet 
so we need to figure out which side you are and then come in and land which should be pretty easy so there we go right let's throttle back a bit you're there okay that's not too bad so we're coming to Gugani 3 Bravo as the text just pop up um, the 2.1 beta is out at the moment for Elite and uh, I've got to say that stuff like that like the pop-ups I mean look look at these canyons they look awesome um, yeah stuff like the pop-up you just got there they've sorted that so that's promising uh, so let's close the distance here a bit there we go if you can hear any sort of cars or anything in the background it's because I've got the window open it's very warm today um, and obviously being in a room with the door shut the PCs do get a little toasty uh, so yeah I've got the window open for to help them and me breathe Right, go on. Need to close the distance a bit more than that. There we go. About 30 degrees, nice. Let's go into the glide. Throttle back. And drop out. There we go. Sweet. Right, that's good depot. Let's request docking with you. Nice. Uh, I'm going here by the looks of things. So let's put the landing gear down. We're at 0 0.11 G's here, so it's not too bad. I mean, uh, just look. Look at my shadow next to the the landing pad. I mean, the attention to detail in this game is immense. It really is. Okay, so. Pad 10, let's line up for you. And now let's. Oh, might have gone a little bit too far to the right there. Let's start coming into a landing position. Now you do have to sort of bear in mind, even though it is only 0 0.11 here, gravity does make a difference. That's not too bad. Went too far off of the mark. And we're down. There we go. Right. So let's hand these missions over, which were dead easy. Pick them up in system, drop them off in system. Let's pick up the bounty vouchers. There we go. Confirm. Thank you. Uh, oh, but it's just free money, basically, isn't it? Bulletin board. Stand by. Right. Microbial furnaces, there we go, have some of those, enjoy. Uh, oh, microbial furnaces, you're going through them this week, aren't you? There we go, oh look, I'm allied apparently. Um, all right, available missions, are you going anywhere exciting? No, you're not. Surface missions, we've got Cracking Down, Green Asylum, da ya ya. Uh, okay, uh, well, we've got a few of them there installations and stuff okay well bored of that now right so uh, did we refuel we did refuel didn't we yes right so let's go we're Akuma now um, and do the other missions if we go to Irakuma let's jump in here and you can see what we've got uh, we have no, that's Latu Gag. Why are we why are we looking at Latu Gag? I don't want to look at frickin' Latu Gag, I want to look at Irikuma. Yeah, we've got a mission there on the planet and one at Blau City. Um but that's fine. Also in the system 
we have in fact let's let's set our destination to there in the system we have a thing to get rid of uh, pirates from the trade route in Irakuma so I'm going to hope believe it or not that I get interdicted um, and then I can kill a pirate and I've completed that mission as well so yeah it uh, pays to stack a few missions up if you can complete them at the same time especially uh, if they're going to the same place like these ones right so let's face the sky head upwards there we go landing gear retracted uh, please tell me my destination is not over there somewhere have we got uh, is it going to tell me to uh, line up with the thing possibly yeah finish. line with target destination oh there we go Irakuma come on engage 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 why are you no engage Four, there we go three, two, one, engage. so we'll just jump I know we were only 5k up and we probably just blew out every window on that space station but never mind it's fine so let's pop over to sunny Irakuma fuel scooping. grab the fuel because why bother fuel buying scooping. it if you can get it for free and head to Blau City and let's hope we get interdicted hopefully uh, do I have an FSD on this? I might have taken it off. Yeah, I did take it off. Um, but that's fine. In fact, have we got a nav beacon here? We do. Let's, let's go to the nav beacon. Um, the reason being is you are definitely going to get pirates there. We only want one. That's all it takes. One pirate. So let's go... Whoa, it's the other side of the star. There we go. Let's go to the nav beacon. Hopefully, we'll slow down in time. I don't think we're going to, though, so let's put it about a little bit. And there we go, we're into the megameters. And that makes a bit more sense. Right, we've got unidentified signal sources. So, I mean, that's the thing. When you're driving around only doing, like, 20 tonnes of cargo and you've got a big cargo hold, you can afford to stop in these little things. When you're trade running, you can't. Because you're full up and you can't take any more. Uh, USS there. Yeah. Cool. Right. Let's get my speed down and we should be able to drop into this very nicely. Kill one pirate and then head to uh, Blau. There we go, right let's drop in. Let's get the, uh, the weapons out straight away. You there, kill back. Are you a pirate? Are you a pirate? I'm gonna scan you. You won't like being scanned, but I don't care. Uh, I'm going to scan you anyway. Scanned. Get scanned, son. Uh, there we go. Oh, you're clean. Eagle, you're going to be clean because you're running escort for whatever that is. Yeah. Uh, what about you, Orca? You might not be clean no you are clean okay you're all nuns great viper uh, you're probably a dirty little viper aren't you you a dirty little viper let's have a look no you're clean viper probably clean clean everybody's clean what's going on um 
type 6 let's have a look at you type 6 uh, you're probably in that wing aren't you oh, you're that you're that Bob Morlock you're there there is an asp floating around in here somewhere type 6 there he is uh, clean, yep. Oh, somebody's got their hard points out over here. Hmm. Somebody be, somebody be a pirate. So those four are all right. And these are all right. What about you, sunshine? Anaconda. You clean. How disappointing. Ah. Let's head over here. There's a couple over here we could look at. Uh, no, probably those. Right, no record, no record. Everybody's got no record. Uh, let's let's have a look at you, Vipper, David Brown. Wanted mission target. Sweet. Let's scan you. Do I have anything of value? Do you know what I do? They're called bullets. Right. There we go. We've scanned you. You're wanted. You're dead. So, let's kill this viper, shall we? Everyone else is probably going to start shooting at him as well. Because they're all here. There's pseudo bounty hunters in game. That's his shields down. So let's pepper him with some bullets. Too much Don't damage. Don't you dare run away. There we go. <laughs> right, mission updated. Got the pirates. Uh, so now let's go to Blau Orbital. Or Blau City. There we go. Got destination. And jump. So yeah, it's only one pirate. It's pretty simple. Fly around Three, five minutes. Two, one, I mean, if we get interdicted, yeah, it could be that their mission targets and not necessarily recognised as pirates especially if they've been um, generated by the mission and not just by the game they may not be seen as pirates so yeah nav beatings are a pretty safe bet you're gonna get one so there we go so that's that one mission done which is nice we are coming into Blau. Blau. So we'll pop in here. Drop this one off, and then I think we've got one more. So we will head to the last one. And I think that'll probably do for the video, actually. Um, but yeah, this is just, you know, mission grinding. I like to have a few different types of missions on the card when I do it. See, so it's not just, you know, jump, drop stuff off, jump, drop stuff off, jump, drop stuff off. I mean, that, that's okay, but you can make more money trading um, than you do with the missions. So, if you're going to do jump, drop stuff off, I'll find a decent trade route. Now, I had been tempted to go back and do the Q QBO run, but uh, it, QBO is not that far from where I am, about 120, 150 light years, um, so it isn't too bad. So I could do that, but uh, I'm just interested to see how long it'll take me to get the next rank. Just 
cracking missions out really. So let's get ready for Blau. So we'll bring her up now and we should be facing the front ish. There we go. Boop. And what do you say? Ah, right end anyway. Okay. So we haven't actually been interdicted yet in Irakuma, which is nice. Uh, well, it will request some of that lovely docking that you have, please. And drop the gears of landing. And we'll line ourselves up. Where are we going? Pad 24. That's not too bad. So let's bring her in to... Bravo. Pad 24. Where's pad 24? Pad 24. My god, we're on the ceiling. Okay. Let's straighten her up. Bring her down. It's quite amusing, actually, um, when I get out of the clipper and I get into a uh, a smaller ship for something because the smaller ones I'm so used to like giving it a long blast with the uh, the thrusters on this to get it to move if you do that on the smaller one you're just in a wall straight away because they're so maneuverable um, right put it in board let's drop these off you can see the conda fund is growing or it could be the cutter fund. Uh, bring animal monitors. There we go. Have some animal monitors for your animals to monitor them. Um, oh, deliver fruit and veg to Lee Ben. 200,000 credits. That's nice. Platinum required. How many do you want? Two. Ten hours. Mm, that's not so bad. Ziegle ring. Uh, 52, mind you it's 75 light years away which is a bit of a pain in here uh, right so there's nothing going back to good guy any anyway which is a shame uh, okay right so next next on the agenda is I think this is another planetary one yeah Cerseve uh, so let's set you up as the destination and we'll launch. So yeah, it's almost like a little round route that we're doing. Um, sort of five missions, I think, in total. All of which will add rank. I mean, have we got up at all? Well, 48%. Yeah. Ship Engines engaged. Slowly but surely. Oh, look at that conda. I want a anaconda. Just for the massive, massive trading capacity that it has. And the fact it still has guns and it isn't a Type 9. I've driven the Type 9. Disappointing, I think, is the word. Right. Sarah Seve, let's head over to you. We should be able to jump any moment. There we go. So yeah, the Type 9 is Four, three, painful. Two, one, utterly, utterly engage. painful. It's so slow. I mean, it is massive. Let, you know, let's be realistic here. The thing is huge. Um, but it takes like a week to get anywhere in it because it is so slow. It's quite expensive as well. I think it's 77 million credits, um, which makes sense. I mean, it is a large ship. There's a lot of stuff there, but 77 million for a barge? Hmm. 
you know, when you consider that uh, I think the Clipper was 22 million um, to buy. I mean, it's worth a damn sight more than that now, the way it's kitted out. But uh, there you go, finance, ship insurance. So yeah, two, two and a half million. So that's that's five percent. So five would be ten percent. So yeah, fifty million in which case um, is roughly what I'm sat in. Now I could sell it. Oh, hello. I could sell this. Um, let's let's see who you are, shall we? Uh, you're in a federal assault ship. Oh, you might actually present a challenge. Under right, let's kill you then, shall we? Target shields offline. Why oh, are you competent rated? Now the federal assault ship actually handles reasonably well. And he's got turrets. Okay. Well, let's put three in, three in shields, three in weapons. Because he's not going to outmaneuver me, uh, even though I can see when I'm outmatched. Well, no, you obviously can't because you interdicted me, you donkey. Right. Let's spin around. There we go. Now the thing you have to watch with these federal ships is they like to ram. I mean, he's only got 2% left, so there we go. You're dead. You're dead. Yes, you are. Right. Thanks for playing. Uh, we'll continue on our journey now. Um, yeah, you have to be aware of those federal ships. They have an awful lot of armour. The shields are a bit meh, but the armour's really good. Now, I don't know what it is about uh, the AI in this game, but if they're in a federal ship, they will ram. So you can do that in uh, the bigger ships. You can get away with ramming stuff. I mean, it's not too bad in this. Um, if you're ramming something smaller, then you're fine. But uh, like the Imperial Cutter is like a thousand tons of ship. That's a lot of ship. And if that rams you, you're pretty much at it. I've yet to see one actually. Federal Corvette or an Imperial Cutter as an AI ship. I wonder, are they in the game? Aren't they? I suppose they must be somewhere, you know. Maybe it's the high danger conflict zones or something. Maybe in there. I don't tend to go in them because I'm not too worried about combat vouchers. Um, but yeah, we'll see. Anyway, say survey. Let's have a look. Coming in to you. I will be in you shortly. So let's not speed down. Figure out where you are on the planet. You're there. Okay, so let's start bringing the nose up and hopefully it's quite pockmarked this planet it's had a fair few uh, asteroid strikes or meteor strikes rather so let's orbital flight engaged let's bring her down and then start bringing the nose up about 30 degrees is where I like it to be We should be able to uh, look at those lovely craters there. Should be around the 40 kilometer mark that we hit um, the glide. 
there, 48. So I'll take a slightly shallower approach to get us there. And there we go, drop in. So, let's... Please tell me that didn't just boost. Request docking. Docking request granted. I think it did. I think I touched tab, which is a bit annoying. Uh, so we're only a kilometre off the ground, so I'll have to be aware of that. There we go. We're going to pad 12, are we? So we're over here. I was looking at pad 3 there, hopefully, but... Yep, there's the old shadow. And you can see the landing gear on the shadow. I mean, if, if I open the fuel, uh, the uh, cargo scoop, I don't know if you can see that on there. Um, no, you can't. But the landing gear, you can definitely see. If I retract it, look. How cool is that, eh? That is attention to detail. Right, pad 12. Oh, look. Fellow clipper. It's obviously the place to be. Right. So let's bring her down. Out here. Yeah, not too far off. There we go. Drop. There we go. Nice. Right, let's pop inside. Uh, reload, refuel, and all that malarkey. Go to contacts. Claim the bounty, because free money. Uh, got black market here. Oh, that's interesting. It's worth remembering. Uh, there we go. Structural regulators. Give you the cargo. Do enjoy. Thank you ever so much. And there we go. Uh, the excitement of doing just basically missions. Um, it's part of the game. So you need to do it. And you get your reputation up. And you get your, uh, your rank up. <sighs> but I wish it was quicker. Anyway, thank you ever so much for joining me guys, hope you enjoyed the video, um, don't forget, if you enjoyed it and you think it was worth it, tap the like button, uh, if you're new here and you'd like to see more then the old subscribe button's for you, and if you have a pearl of wisdom you wish to let me know um, something I'm not doing or I'm doing wrong, then please head down to the comment section and uh, leave me a note there. Well, thank you ever so much for watching, but for now, Commander Random, signing off. Take care, guys, and I will see you again in the next one.